welcome so in this video we are going to see something more interesting because you know uh, i'm going to test this on live market like lively what it's going to give and uh, you know it's like going to give the patterns already i think we have just researched about this so we are going to check that uh, before running this close other files and i will open the local folder i think uh, the screen would be visible now let me make this small okay so let's start i'm just going to run this bot uh, this bot you know very well like previously we just used to for finding out uh, signals for our indian market uh, we are going to check this on live market because we just checked in lot of things but we need to check it on live market because in offline we checked in previous video in this video i'm just going to run for live market checker so let's see what are like it's going to check 283 stocks from nse okay it's going to check it from there uh from there uh, it's going to take the stock and it's going to show it for us so within that uh, i will open the screen now so that it will be easier for <sighs> okay okay i'm back uh first you know main thing is we have to allow this bot to analyze because we just given nearly you know i just filtered i just taken nine patterns now we are just having only nine patterns inside which is like giving you more than 65% accuracy so these patterns will help to give 65 like 65% more accuracy so that's where we are going to check it because even i don't know what kind of signals are going to come because previously i didn't uh, run the pattern for indian market i'm just checking only the back testing and everything but now i'm just uh, checking the real uh, trade and real uh, entries let me see what's going to happen and we can filter with the real market because it's very important and if you see the risk reward ratio is like calculated from 1 to 1 if you are focusing on tp1 and tp2 the tp2 would be 1 to 1 or uh, if you are focusing on tp3 it's like 1 is to 2 okay so that's the thing if you have a 50 like if you have a more than 50 percentage accuracy uh, like 50 to 60 percentage you can focus on 1 is to 1 and if you have a uh, like 40 percentage accuracy it's more than enough you have to 1 is to 2 risk reward ratio like for example if your stop loss is 1 rupees your take profit is 2 rupees that is like 1 is to 2 risk reward ratio so for these kind of strategy if you are following 1 is to 2 risk reward ratio you can focus on uh, Uh, like a forty percentage and above. Like if you have forty percent accuracy at the end, uh, you would be in profit. So that's the scenario. Uh, same time, if you goes with uh, one is to one risk reward ratio, you need to have a sixty percentage accuracy. If you are focusing on one is to one point one risk reward ratio, you you have to focus on fifty percentage accuracy. So that's what. If you are focusing on one is to three risk reward ratio, you like three. Three thirty percent accuracy in uh, like enough. For example, if you are taking ten trades, if you are focusing on risk reward of one is to three, uh, you can focus on three trades. You can uh, make profit and seven trades. If you are picking loss also, it's fine. At the end, you will be in profit. Okay. So let's begin. I think uh, it's given uh, entry for J P Powers. For J P Power, there are two uh, patterns has been formed and two patterns showing take a long entry at fourteen rupees fourteen point zero two. Okay. Let me check. JP Power. So JP Power. Uh, let me check with the Indian market. Uh, it's showing to take a you know a live entry. Like nearly, it's it's like. Let me check one more time. It's checking to take entry at fourteen point zero two rupees, and the accuracy is seventy percentage, like seventy five percentage. and it's go, it's giving like tp1 tp2 and everything and both both the patterns are focusing on long trade so we can blindly take entry on where it's saying like 14.02 i think it will take time because analyze uh, like now the entry has came now you have to take entry at this point okay so 14.02 i think now it's like 01 so let me little bit little bit 02 now the 02 that that's the entry point uh, let me go with the tp1 which is like 14.1 Fourteen point one, which is like a uh, little bit only little profit, but the, if you see, if you calculate the profit percentage, which is like zero point five percentage, okay. So fourteen point zero one. So that's the first target level which I'm marking, and second target is fourteen point three. Let me, I'm 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 not going to go with the zero point one one that and all. So fourteen point three. 
so 14.3 would be the second target and uh, 14 uh, like uh, 14.3 is the third target 14.17 is the second target sorry i just missed the second target focused on third target 14.17 would be we can keep it at 18 okay mm -hmm. so this is the first target and this is the second target for us so let's see what's going to happen Uh, let's wait for the thing guys because you know I got a call sorry you know I'm not editing anything because uh, we would be leaving the perfect entry and exit points so that's what uh, I'm not leaving in between and going so from year to year the profit range is 0 0.61 okay it's fine okay let me keep the stop loss also which is like 13.8 you can keep it at 13.8 no, no need to go like uh, more decimal values 13.8 which is like your okay so that would be your stop loss level uh, but it's showing like 13.88 it's showing even if you want to keep like accurately where it's showing you can keep it like 13.88 let me check one more time 13.88 okay it's fine now let's see what's going to happen uh, guys it will take time you know it will take time it won't happen very quickly uh, even you know if the accuracy is 70 and above it means that your tp1 and maximum tp2 will achieve only tp3 it's like question mark so if you are person if you're taking more risk you can go ahead but I, i'm not recommending to take more risk okay uh, eventually we can check some more cryptos but you know only one signal as of now only one signal guys because now the time is like around 12:30. Uh, uh, only one signal has came you can see it's a live market i'm just zooming out little bit more only one signal guys the profit is confirmed let's see there uh, when we are making it out like I, like you know you just imagine if you're buying only one quantity the 10 paise profit is very low but if you're buying like 100 200 quantity just imagine so if you're buying 100 quantity you would be having 10 rupees of profit if you're buying like 100 quantity would be coming around 1400 rupees if you're like uh, investing 1 lakh just imagine uh, you would be having a profit of first tp for example from year till year when we calculate when it's achieving the first tp level if you calculate um, let me calculate 14 0 0.10 into i think it would be like around 10000 quantity i guess so it would be like around your profit range of 1000 or 2000 rupees you can make with the first tp level but the initial capital you should have a little bit more when you're coming to live trade uh, obviously you should have a little bit more capital guys because you can't go like blind entries it's very very important okay So let's begin uh, till it's achieving some TP or SL level. Let me watch because you know we have to know what's going to happen. Let me copy this and I will paste it. Uh, I will paste it there. Let me copy this and I will try to paste it on the chart so that it will be helpful for you to see what has given on that place okay so this is the thing which is given by our bot like both uh, both pattern has been formed one is like rounding bottom and another one is like uh, cup and handle i think most of the people who are all following patterns you will know that so both the pattern is showing like long entry it means that like uh, two patterns came in two patterns long entry it means that the accuracy is a little bit more because both the patterns are showing the market is going to go up so and one more thing what we have to see is the entry points even the entry point is also same okay so we have to see that and the exit points also almost same so we, we can uh, focus on this because now the market timing is this so today only one signal came i'm just showing it now because i'm, I'm not back to, like I, I didn't test it before I didn't test it at morning or I didn't run at the board, board at evening or anywhere. I'm just checking it lively and I'm just showing what's going to happen. Let's see what's going to happen. Uh, 
I think it will take some time guys because it can take one hour or two hour I don't know how much length the video is going to go uh, even I don't know if I'm not having storage it can get off in between if it's getting off don't need to worry I will post the continuation video at next part like part 2 or continuation video so that it will be easier for you but if it's achieving within the video it's fine but if it's taking a lot of time uh, we don't know because it will happen within today it will achieve the stop loss or it will achieve the TP it will anything will happen so you, you need to be focused on that okay Uh, one more thing is like I'm not a financial advisor or I'm not like uh, you know SEBI uh, registered advisor or anything I'm just you know programmer same time uh, I'm also like into trading so much I'm just researching about lot of AI nearly you know just as of now I'm just having more than 25 trading bots which is like uh, 20 of them are working very good the problem is you know I want to mix everything in a single bot so that it can run in any market condition because most of the board which I have now will be like you know running on uptrend, downtrend and uh, um, range boundary market but I'm just focusing on neutral like in any market condition it, sh it should take a own decision but the problem is if you're building what something like that we should have a huge capital because for averaging for edging it will take multiple entries and it should fetch lot of data from exchange you know this binance is having some restrictions you we can't uh, fetch 2000 uh, plus data within a second but uh, in uh, in the final bot you know like uh, on the final bot i need like around 15000 data per second that's the problem you know they just uh, restricted my uh, IP address from Binance uh, from outside we can take data but the problem is we won't get the accurate data accurate price point but I'm just working on that because I need nearly 15,000 to 20,000 data to filter within a second that's where it the bot like uh, we are just building a AI based bot right so it yeah, it should think by itself and should uh, take entry exit and everything by itself so that's the thing guys okay Let's see. let's wait let's wait the problem in uh, Indian market is this we won't have much volatility compared to uh, crypto market or uh, US stock market so that's the different and that's where you know it's taking lot of time to going up uh, that's the biggest problem in Indian market the volatility is very low compared to other markets thing is you know like floating like anything I don't know how much time it's going to take I think uh, after this video recorded I think I can uh, take the end point of that video I think that would be better right but the problem is I'm not having storage okay till now I will stop the video and uh, we can continue after the target achieved 